Uh, God, it's been a while. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Skyrim. I'm not gonna lie, I apologise for um, being so like busy. I, I haven't uploaded recently. Just things even happening in life. Oh my God, it's like a living with Lydia. Easy. All right. Did you? Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? That way. So, let's go. See how he lives. Two will just have to learn to How do we do long that? and till we can build Let's you go. another house. Have this way, that'll never location down just because I can let's go Oh, it's been a while. This is, this, it's good to come back. You know, I, I, I was a bit busy this weekend. Oh god! Ah! Oh, okay. Won't be doing that any more time anytime soon. Um, yeah, no, it's good to come back. Been a bit busy, I'm not gonna lie. Stuff in my personal life. But hey, I've got this episode coming up. to this place, deliver the thing, then turn it, and then we're going to have that lady as our wife. I don't know why, it's like a tradition for me, but that is the, I think that was the first ever person I ever got married to in Skyrim, and ever since I've just stayed with this person. I could get married to Lydia, wherever she may be. Oh my god, that is a beautiful moon. I could get married to Lydia, but she's going to be like my companion for now, I guess, maybe, I don't know. The only person that would be able to kill said companions is you. So, but if you get married in Skyrim, you cannot remarry. Once you marry someone, that's it. So, my plan is that if I marry said person, I then have someone at home doing money when I'm travelling about the place. And I won't have to worry, because every day I'll get an extra hundred coins, I think. Found the most amazing tree You're looking for work? Right it's a shame our daughter could make the he journey herself, but at least she still thinks of us. If you wouldn't mind bringing this back to her for us, I'd appreciate it. Until next time. 
The Greybeards have summoned the... Go. I may have waited over a little bit too long. Let's go inside. Howdy. Welcome to Shore Stone. Ah, uh, yes. Seems he sent back my satchel stuffed with letters. I look forward to reading them. I appreciate the delivery. Here, I want you to have this. I insist. I don't know if that helps if I like do that. Interested in me, are you? Well, yes. Why wouldn't I be? Are you interested in me? Maybe. It's settled then. Brief as life can be in Skyrim, at least we'll have each other. You don't even know me. See, this is what I find funny. And I remember the first time playing this. Like, th th they say that. But you don't know me. I've literally just done an errand for you. I literally delivered some mail and that's it. Alright. Miscellaneous. Speak to Marmo about arranging your wedding. Let's go to Riften. That's cool. Oh, no, no. Seconds. Seconds, people. Those of you who played 360 Skyrim on disc, you'll know, and I've said this previously, but honestly, I don't think you understand how long it felt you had to wait between each time you fast travel. Because there's a lot of fast travel. Like, going through doors like this, you would have had to have waited Blessings like of Mara 10 Apanya. seconds. You wish to be married? It's good to see love blossoming even during these difficult times. Sorry, not in it for the money. Your wedding will be held tomorrow, from dawn until dusk. Don't be late. You don't want to miss your own wedding. Attend your wedding. May you return to her benevolence in safety. Uh, so tomorrow. Until How may I help you, dusk. my son? Visit Rifton. All. Uh, right. So it's five now. So then plus seven will make it twelve. See what happens if I make it twelve? Because I, I know there's very diff. Like you have to be there at specific times. Uh, Welcome at the temple. I think, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna get married. Your boy is getting in. Oh, look ah, at him! Here's the look at him! Groomer. Look at this bow! Let's begin look the ceremony. Him. It was Mara oh, that hello. first gave birth to all of creation. And pledged to watch over us she as her children. Left the at home, honey. It is oh, from right. her love of us that we first learned to love one another. It is from this love that we learned that life lived alone with no life at all. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to okay. bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life and in the next. Prosperity, oh, Lydia. Poverty, Lydia's proper into this. She's like, oh yeah. Goodness. Do you agree to be bound together? Who are these other people? Now and forever. I mean, they might be family, but. I do. Now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love? Now, now and, forever. and forever. Stop the wedding! I can't go through with this. Under the authority of Mara, the divine of love, I declare this couple to be wed. I present the two of you with these matching rings, blessed by Mara's divine grace. You don't actually need to wear these. May they protect each of you in your new life together. We're married. I guess we'll need to decide where we're living, won't we? You can always stay with me. Yep, I'm gonna have to. Our new home. I'll see you there. Until... Until... One gets his own place. Congratulations on your wedding. A fine day to you, friend. May you. Uh, Fast travel, are you ready? One, 
two. Two seconds. All right, let's go. Let's go and visit our house. Visit our home. Of lovely warm. I unlocked it because I have a key. Because I'm married. Look at me go. I'm an actual G. What's in this chest? Mine, mine, mine. Now that other. Mine. I'll take the glass because I'll oh wait. I'll take the glass because I'm gonna need it for materials. Because materials is gonna be a pain in the back to get. And you'll know what I mean by materials more later on. I don't know if I'll, I'll, I might start it this episode. I don't think I can yet because I've got to do quite a bit in Fall Creeth because that's where I'll start. But I have the Hearth Fire DLC, which means I can adopt children. <coughs> oh, excuse me, and build houses. Where are we going to go? Right, let's, let's do this. Box, uh, map. Where are we going to go? We've got to go to white. Oh, no, we've got to go to white. Fast travel! Dun -dun 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 -dun. Here we are. Riverwood Trader. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Ooh. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Keep your hands to yourself. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood... Uh, yeah, the, we, we did have a, a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I, 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 you mean this golden globe? You found it! <laughs> there it is! Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Boys, that's mine. I can take it. Oh, hey, oh. hands off! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What do you think you're doing? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, wait. General stats. Crime. Okay. That, that there used to be like a major thing, so. Okay. You could have just, just asked. asked. I added my. Oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is why. Oh. By the order of the Yarl, stop right there. Are you threatening me, Master Jedi? Are you threatening me? I'd rather die than go to prison. Oh, forgive me, Thane. I didn't realize it was you. We'll look the other way this time. But even the Yarl's influence has its limits. Be more careful. Yeah, that's what I thought. I have one! 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 Alright, calm yourself, you chicken McNugget. I will s I order the Yarl. Stop right there. Well, that's what it's like to s the life of crime. Um, where are we going to go? Speak to the Greybeards or locate okay, Rignor. Speak to the Greybeards. I want to have the full potential of the voice. I want to know what it's like. Alright, where am I going to go? I've got to go up there. I need to go to Iverstead, that's right. You have to go around the mountain. I know that much. Right. Steps again, Clement? Not today. I'm just not ready to make a climb to High Rock Guard. The path isn't safe. Look at where you like. 
I think I'll do the storyline for the most of the I'll do the great bits. I'll get the full potential of what I can learn. I might do. I kind of want to start towards Valkyrie, just so I can have my own house that I can build. Although building it will be actually no. Oh, I could build a house or I could buy one in White Run, and I know I'm pretty sure I can't have people staying at my house in Perfire DLC. So I'm gonna have to buy one in Breeze Home. Breeze Home's the name of the white run house you can buy. But I know it's gonna cost 5,000, so let's see how much I have. I have 1,108. Alright. So, you know, what can you do? Did you do? I might join the um, Thieves Guild to be because then I'll. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragon's bruce. Sided uh, over the corn masses, men were weak then and had no voice. Set up the path to high. Hmm? Good day. spirits of men were strong in the old in old times and unafraid to all the dragons in their voices but only their dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. Give me the money. Pretty sure there's a frost troll. Pretty sure. I have been. 
Uh, I did appreciate it on Xbox, but man, that was I was young and naive back then. So now I'm a bit like oh, I want a computer. I yes. All right. Okay, right. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Save because we we we're stupid like that. Hi there. Bayesmir, you won't leave here alive. <laughs> That was unexpected, that turn of events. I have now killed the woman. Where is this place? Where is it? I can't. No, I said. Oh my god, I wonder if I still think. Men who man prevailed shouting out the the world, proving that their voice was more strong, though their sacrifices were many. I've never actually read those, like these. Yeah, it's actually pretty symbolic, like telling the story. That's the frost beast, that's a that's a thing. I I why? Okay, why? Oh no, stay up there. Oh no. You don't have to come over here, okay? You don't have to come over here.
I press E. I press E. What? Oh god, I've got to walk so far. No. Why? Why? Oh my god, I'm back here. I'm back here. For God's sake. I haven't got time for you, love. I'm sorry if you feel offended when I say this. Come on. By Ishmael, you won't leave here alive. <laughs> Like I, could, I, I know I'm probably gonna have to command you, but I need Lydia. Like Lydia is so helpful. I don't think you understand what, what my life. 
life is going to be like if I don't have linear. Come on. Oh, God. Ah! Oh. 
We are victorious. We have slain the beast. Lydia. Lydia. Oh my God. It was awful. It was the worst. In fact, I killed Lydia more times than I died. That's how tragic it was. But hey, fourth or the fifth time of the charm, right? Stick to the bow. I enjoy sneaking and archery because if they can't see you in front of range, it's fun. Growing tons the sky children come with found in the first empire of small ones whilst the dragon can drink from this world. Dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Yep. First, let us see if you truly are Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Demonstrate your unrelenting force. Are you ready? Boom! Yeah. Yeah. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Rothka. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Why? Have they lost now, their voice? tell me, Dragonborn. Have they lost their way with the voice? Why have you come here? Uh, I want to find out what it means to be. Well, we are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. <laughs> you are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only well, dragon no, born of this age, that, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Oh uh, wait, Septim must be in a different era then. Or Timber Septim, whatever his name is. Uh, I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are dragon born. You have the inborn gift. Inborn. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? 
Marines to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting nice your voice That's into a thoom, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you I shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your what dragon blood guys, gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, a second word in unrelenting force. Ro means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Ro. Look at that. Oh. It's early. Learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Great promise, Dragonborn. And uh, what can I say? It's a gift. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Body. Master Bolognese. Or Master Body. Morris the Boris. I mean, look at you. Absolute demon. I bet you're the guy who gets to the party and gets all laid every night. You look that kind of guy. I mean, these guys have got nothing on you. These guys are the nerd squad. You, you sir, you are the one who's the top dog around this place. Master Bori will teach you Wold, which means whirlwind. Oh. Okay. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Alrighty then. You guys are psychopaths, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were into that kind of sort of stuff, you know. I'm not particularly into children molestering myself, you know. Approach Master Bori and he will gift you his knowledge of wood. Master 
scared. The Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. The Wolfgar. You, 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 you are. Master Bori. Rex. Wolf. Now, your turn. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Quick mastery of a new thumb is uh, astonishing. astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself? I know. I thought it'd be easy. I don't know. I just, it just happens. You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder. From his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Okay. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Drink. You what do you dare. say to some cheap? You're the one they call Dragonborn. Then it is too late. The lie has already taken root in the hearts of men. So we shall expose to them the falseness in their hearts by tearing out yours, all Deceiver. Right. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. of the Dragonborn, and who among us could possibly hold that on with such power?
we should be a bit more careful. Let's crouch. Down we go. good. I am too good. Sit down. Sit down. Just sit down. Oh wait, put it away, sorry. I was tab. Whoops. Uh, right. Increase health. Someone there. I thought there was uh, lots of different things have changed. I should assume that enemies are all around all the corners and different times. Why are there so many different like things down here? Ragged flagger. Give it up, radio. Those days are over. I'm telling you, this. W well, well. Color me impressed. That's American. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. No risk, no reward. That's the way it goes, so you better get used to it. All right, all right. Now, if you're done belly aching like a child, how about handling a few deadbeats for me? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I, I want see. you to explain to them the error of their ways. Kirava, Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. 
do this right, this, then I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Bad for business. Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. Have anything for... Kirava's stubborn. Talk to Tal and Jay at the Bean Barb, and see if you can get something out of him. They're... Good well acquainted. You'd better have to coin to pay for your drink. I'll be here for no you. No handouts here. Thanks. Determine the word for your success in action. Over here. Hi there. Come to see Balaman perform miracles with the finest weapons and armor. Take a look. You wish to do what I do? Very well. Because I need to save up for a house. What do you want? I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Been smitten with her ever since. In fact, I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. Aww. In Blackmarsh, tradition dictates we present a potential mate a unique wedding ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band, but all I need are three flawless amethysts to complete the setting. I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask such a favor of you. I thank you. With the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kirava has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. Just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend to. Here for a room or something to drink? Show me. No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. How could you possibly know about it? Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. Very well. Here. Take this back to Brynjolf, and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. Yeah. You, you, you seem to be... you were a bold one, but I put you down. I said... My skill in battle is unmatched. I've got hit. Fortunately for you. What, what can I say? You know, she might be... Uh, I don't know. She's just... I think... No. Even though, like, I'm married. By the gods, it's true, isn't it? 
A dragon has attacked White Run. Why are you How here? could mere men bring down such a beast? So can I int what? Oh, it's one of you people. Hey. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? You're gouging me for what little coin I make, and you can't even protect yourselves? Ridiculous. Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of Riften. I'm going to make you sorry for this. Come on, then! You think you're hard. Come on. Let's see what you're made of. That's your Come best! Come on! He's not so tough! Up! This end! I'll rip your head off! Come on! He's not so tough! Are you just gonna stand there and take it? Fight back! Please, no more. They keep giving I'll and pay. getting embarrassing. I'll pay. And they'll keep taking and taking. Here. When is it gonna end? What would you have me do, woman? Cross the guild? Take them all on, one by one? You know I don't mean that. We need to find a way out of this. Perhaps Dr. Layla. My husband Bearsing will be the death of me. Oh, he spends stupid. too much time working. You were supporting him? What the hell? All right. Look at that ring. That's cool. Uh, It's you. Please, don't hurt me. I know who you are. You've been terrorizing the entire city. Yeah, you better. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the payment. Why couldn't you have just done that in the first place? Why do you have to be a bitch about it? Sorry about the mess. Keeping this place clean is quite a chore. Mm. Oh dear, well, that's where my college work went. I, 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 I found my, my college work. Um, yeah, I go to college. Um, my friend has just messaged me saying he has my work, so that's, that's fun. At least I know where it is now. So, job's done. Well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Here you go. I think you'll find these quite useful. Next, then. Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeepers, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. That's the spirit. Larceny's in your blood. The telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. What's on your mind? We've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Fair enough? Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me and I'll show you what we're all about? Ooh, taking care of business. Loud Let me show you the operation, then right. you can ask your questions. Open strange cabinet. I didn't even. Just this way. Keep. <laughs> I didn't see that. All 
Right, let's do this. Keep following. It isn't far. Let's wait until Brynjolf's here before we Mercer, begin. This is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources, Brynjolf. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. If you break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. What we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? Rules will thieves, what's the point of rules? Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Goldenflow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work, so let him prove it. Goldenglow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brynjol will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Mm -hmm. Since Brynjol assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Alright. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin, so don't disappoint me. I'll try not to. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tonelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. Okay. It's owned by some smart mouthed wood elf named Arangoth. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the safe in the main house. The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Aye, the last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive, but if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. Okay. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. Okay, let's travel to... Stone, there it is. See our wife, see how much money she's made during this episode. Honey, is that you, darling? Everything was going great in Red Belly. Then the damn. Hello, my love. We have a cozy little profit. Here, this is your share. Oh, love. thank you. 100. Wow. One day, eh? Goodbye, my love. Guys, it's gonna have to be the end of this episode. It's good to be back. We got married. We killed a frost troll after like I don't know 20 minutes. Uh, learned the ways of the fool, uh, but we have a lot more potential. We have a lot more to explore as well. This is just tipping the iceberg. We got these dude with the cultists, which I have no idea what that's about. Um, we got to do the wind wind jarl thing. I can't remember his name. The grey beards dude. Uh, got a dude rift. And uh, Thieves Guild stuff, and I've got to do Fulcreef, because that's just something I would like to do, because Fulcreef is like her fire, which is building a house, and Fulcreef is the easiest one, in my opinion, of the three, to get a house at, so, but that's just something I'd like to do in the future episode. but until then, I'll see you, you guys in the good old next episode, goodbye!